This company is called MSC Industrial Direct. The ticker symbol is MSM. Is this the one that Michael Burry had? MSC Industrial Direct. Uh, through its subsidiaries, is one of the largest industrial equipment distributors in the U.S., distributing more than 1.5 million mm. metalworking and other industrial products. They should be selling my DGF, but they're not yet. I'll get on that. But in any case, Paul, do you want to take a look at this company? Let's do it. $4.7 billion market cap, PE of 20.9, so it's an X technically. Um, profit margin of 7.4X as well. Um, Uh-oh. Yeah. Free, free cash flow in the last year was 372. Uh, five year average free cash flow is 285, so it's definitely growing. And a dividend yield of 3.5%, which eats up 167 million of their 372 million. Because remember, folks, dividends aren't always secure. If they don't have the free cash flow to play them, you might be in a dividend trap. Dividend trap. But guys, you know what I like? Look at this return on invested capital. Average over the last five years, 14.5%. This is very good. I look for 15% or so. But this shows that they take their money and they get high returns on investment from it. And I like that a lot. Um, if you're paying fair value for a company, this is the price, this is the return you can expect on the company as it grows. It takes all its cash flow and all of its profit and reinvests it at that rate of return. Do you want to look at pillar number three, the revenue growth? Yep, let's look at it. Again, we're doing MSC Industrial Direct. Go ahead, Paul. 2.84 to 3.14, check mark. But it is down a little bit since 2019 so you have to understand why that is too net income yeah profit 230 to 224 x uh -oh. yeah on. it's very consistent profit in the last 10 years I and mean, this is a very boring company look at the profit 10 years ago 230 profit last year 224 so it's very consistently boring which isn't a no to me which i actually kind of like um ron asks should we be streaming on twitch ron will you give me some information i know anything i thought it was for gamers so at the moment, uh, today, no, but I'd be interested in learning what Twitch is. I mean, I know what it is, but come on. All right, uh, shares outstanding, Paul. It's pillar number five. I love you, Ron. 56.3 million shares to 55.66, so that's a check right there. Oh, it's going down. Okay, check. We're doing good so far. Shares outstanding. Oh, we already did the nope, shares No, my apologies. Current assets over current liabilities is pillar number six. Um, yes, current assets, 1.15 billion. Current liabilities, 500 million check mark there. And they pretty much have enough money on hand to pay off all their liabilities. They have 1.15 billion in cash. They have 1.16 in total liabilities. So it's hard for companies that have enough cash on hand to pay off their debts to go broke. So I like that a lot. Major check mark there. Yep. Okay. Free cash flow growth is pillar number seven, the granddaddy of them all. So the average is about 285 million. They went from 270 to 372, check mark there. 270, 210, 288, 283, uh, 372. So check mark and 285 million is the average. Uncle Seth. I just caught on. You 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 hired the developers to give you your average so I don't have to do it anymore. Correct. I love you. You know I love you. I just need to get it put over here. So Seth, what was the market cap of the company? 4.7 billion is the market cap. So 4.7 billion divided by 285 million. 285, uh, 16.5, Paul. That's a check mark there then. Now, I will say this. I don't like this number. The company is not growing. There's no growth potential. Even though it's a check mark, it's less than 20, it's not low enough. I want to pay uh, I, I want to pay a lower a lower amount for this company. How much lower? I like the return on invested capital of 14.5%. Uh, so I'm going to sit there and say maybe 12 times free cash flow. So that is 2.85 plus 570 is... 3.4 billion. And what's the current value? 4.7 4. 4. billion. So it needs to go down by 25%. What's the current price? $88. So I need to be at 66 bucks. This is your target price for so 66 uh, to 70. And I think you'll do pretty well. I think you'll be able to easily get, and I like the, the, the balance sheet. Um, I like it. I mean, listen, it's not much of a drop, 20% drop you need. You need a 20% drop to be in the price range. That's the way I would look at it. Um, I, is it big enough to do puts on? Go ahead, Probably Mel. not. Probably not. I would guess no, but um, I don't know. Why don't you pull up an options chain and check? I will. Mo, you want to go over some trading on this company? Yeah, sure. Oh, Paul, they're average. Oh, am I looking at the right thing? What? MSM, right? Yeah, I don't know. This is going to be hard to do puts on, but I Why? think. Why? What's the volume? 400,000 a day average. Oh, that's <laughs> Yeah. So. 
Again, we're in the, that overbought range up top, so I'm not loving that. And we can see, so on my charts, when I do get my red line, which is my percent K, rolling under and my roll, going under my yellow line, which is my percent D, I turn red on my candlestick chart. So we are flirting with that right here back, say, a week ago. That makes me a little bit nervous that we're in this overbought range. Um, and today's price is at the bottom of the candlestick. So if I'm doing something with this, I also just noticed the bid and ask difference is 12 cents. So, man, this is another one where I'm thinking, I'm thinking you don't do anything with it, but if you absolutely want to, you can go ahead and buy, if you can break out um, above this previous high from last Friday. Um, but again, this is one of those companies with an average volume of 400,000. This is even less than the last one that we just looked at. In my opinion, you guys should be looking at companies to trade with average volumes of a million shares or more per day. Thanks so much for watching the video. We hope you were intrigued. If this style of investing speaks to you, click the link below to join our Patreon. As a patron, you get access to a wonderful community of like-minded investors where you can chat, connect, ask questions, and share ideas with badasses like you all over the world. The best part is you get the amazing Everything Money software. This is revolutionary unlike any YouTube page. Yep. You can track your investments, look at stocks, and quickly run our eight pillar analysis on any company you like. Yeah. The top tier patrons get direct access to Paul and Trader Mo. You'll see their daily trades, their updated portfolios, and every options contract they write on a daily basis. We provide Patreon exclusive videos just for you, including live streams and exclusive content from our team. Our bottom patron tiers fill fast, so join today. But hey, if you don't believe me, look at all of our patrons' amazing success stories. In comparison to other financial platforms, our software is by far the best value. This is your chance to get serious about investing. Yep. If you're finally ready to level up your investing game, join our Patreon and let's start kicking ass together.